everybody. I may or may not be listening to Christmas music. May. Um, so those of you who know me, I come from a family that is full of Christmas cheer. And um, my great grandmother and my dad were huge in the Christmas. So Christmas was one of the best holidays um, of the year. We always um, loved Christmas. Ah. I fix this. Okay. So um, with that being said, my girls are being raised to have Christmas is like one of their favorite times of the year. Um, we've been singing Christmas carols already for weeks. Uh, we're watching Christmas movies. Um, Rudolph the red Nose Reindeer is like our favorite. Um, lots of fun. We love Christmas. So, um, sharing the Christmas cheer. Um, don't mind the hair and everything. I'm a hot mess today. Been cleaning. I'm getting ready to bring up all the Christmas decorations, which is a lot. <laughs> I have a huge basement and it's loaded with Christmas stuff. I think there's more Christmas stuff down there than anything. Um, so it's going to be fun um, getting all the Christmas decorations up here. I thought about doing it by myself. Um, I may just do that. Have Chris bring everything up, take the kids to go play outside, and I get all the fragile things out and put together. I'm really nervous about bringing up the Christmas tree. We have one, two, three, four, I think five Christmas trees. Five. We have two white, one, two. I bought a 12 or 13 foot tree last year. So it's gonna go right in, um, right there on the stair by the staircase. Um, that should be fun decorating. Um, so really kind of nervous about decorating that one because it's huge um, and I have Cece um, those of you who don't know Cece is my little monster she is um, fearless I love her energy um, her personality is just definitely um, she's full of spunk she's full of life um, and I love everything about her but She's also like a Tasmanian devil. She tears through the house and it's like a tornado blew up um, in my house like within 10 minutes of her being in a room. So I'm really nervous about the tree coming down, um, <laughs> decorations being thrown all over the place, and um, possibly small ones trying to be put in mouths, um, ears, nose, God knows where, um, probably down my vents. You never know with CC. So, I'm going to do something real quick. Um, doot, doot. So, um, definitely have been super busy over this way. Um, trying to get everything situated between school um, with the girls. They were sick last week. Um, that kept me really, really, really busy. Um, so, and then just getting ready for the holidays. You know, we have a lot going on over here. Um, and just a lot. Hey, Mandy. Um, so, uh, I'll see if the trees go up or not sooner than later. I really want them to go up because I love them. But last year, she already started exploring them. Um, I'm really just afraid of a 12-foot tree coming down on her. <laughs> um... I love live trees, and I really, really, really want one badly, but I'm afraid of her eating the pine needles and literally just destroying it. So, um, contemplating a real one or not this year, we may just wait one more year. So anyway, the whole point of this uh, live was not to talk about Cece, um, but she is a topic of a lot of conversations, is I'm playing Santa. I have 20 stockings, 20 little stockings, and I have... Um, 20 uh, stockings that I'm going to fill with Thrive. Um, I have 20 people that I'm looking for who would love, love to experience what Thrive is all about. Um, it's something that has changed my life. Um, this is my second winter with Thrive, and I'm more than grateful that I started because with as cold as it can get sometimes in the winter, my body doesn't hurt. My body doesn't have discomforts. I wake up. I'm not stiff. 
Um, and I'm happy. Winter brings on the winter blues for a lot of people. And, you know, it's there's a lot going on through the winter months. You got the holidays, the chaos, the, the hustle and bustle of everybody, um, whether it's travel or shopping or even just the everyday grocery shopping or everyday post office delivery. It's crazy during the holidays. So I definitely want to get at least um, 20 people out there to experience Thrive. You have to experience it. Um, it's, it's something that um, I can't explain to you. I can tell you all the amazing things it's done for me, but until you experience it for yourself, you'll never know. Um, and even if you're just like, you're curious, you're, you're skeptical, you just want to see, you want to prove me wrong, go for it. Um, message me, shoot me your, um, a message, comment below, um, whatever you want to do. Um, scream at me, wave at me, um, whatever, just do it. Um, I got 20 of them going out. On top of these 20, I'm putting in a surprise. So message me. I'll give you the details on the surprise. Um, plus, if you decide, you know what, you know, most people, these samples, these trial samples are to show you the simplicity of the product. I want you to see what it feels like to thrive. But on day 10, I guarantee you, you'll be reaching through the phone, you'll be flying over here to my house, you'll be running over to my house if you're local, and you'll give me a hug because you'll be thankful about how you feel on day 10. So, um, I have three mornings going out to everybody. I have vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry going out to everybody. So, these are the three simple steps. You take two capsules, two capsules, that's the women's, we have men's, um, strawberry, vanilla, and chocolate. Tastes like The chocolate tastes like um, a Wendy's uh, Frosty, whatever it's called. The strawberry is just amazing. And the vanilla to me tastes like a cake batter. Super amazing. Um, and then you slap on just one of these, one of these uh, Christmas DFTs actually. Um, and that's it, you're done for the day. Lines on my arm. Um, put it anywhere on your body. Three simple steps. Two capsules before your feet hit the floor in the morning. 15, 30 minutes later, you drink a lifestyle mix, which is loaded with pro and prebiotics. It's so amazing. And then slap on your DFT. That's it. Um, so I'm putting together 20 stockings. Comment below. Message me. If you'd like one of these mailed to you, um, let me know. Um, can you guys hear me okay? Chris is going to be mad I'm giving away his chocolate. Oops. Um, and my surprise for what, if, when you guys message me, I have a surprise. Um, they're in my box, so. Can't think. The surprise is amazing, you guys. You won't want to miss the surprise. Can you guys hear the Christmas music? Aren't these adorable? So all your little goodies are inside. Can you guys see? So all three steps. And then I have a little, um, uh, can't spit it out. It's a little card. Basically it explains how to take it. Um, I'll talk to you and tell you how to take it as well. And if you have any questions, let me know. <coughs> Sorry, I'm talking too much. So you're going to love this, you guys. Hold on. All right, anyone have any questions? Oh, I don't have any albums, Mandy. My dad has all those. Um, I just use the TV <laughs> or Pandora or um, I use Amazon Prime a lot now, actually. Um, so right now I'm just using the TV since I'm on my phone. So here we go. These are adorable, you guys. You guys don't believe me, I have 20. <laughs> I went and took all of the um, all of the stockings at Target this morning. Um, the lady's like, "What are you doing?" I said, "It's a surprise." She was like, "I want to know. I want to know." So I had to tell her, and I got her set up. So, um, any questions by anybody? <coughs> I need some water. Oh my goodness. Everybody needs cafe 
I'm opening, I've been out, I gave all mine away, and I've been out, so I've been like going crazy without my cafe. Oh, Mandy, I do need to hear his album. I have, um, my dad has a lot of Christmas albums. Um, he's one of those. Um, I think I only have Holly Jolly and then like Rudolph. I have Mariah Carey too, that's back olden days. And Hanson, I have Hanson's Christmas, I know. Don't ask. He was my idol, they were my idols. Um, so, all right guys, everyone that is hopping on, hold on, it's like I can't cut and talk at the same time. So the UPS guy got here and I my shipment said can't track and I was freaking out because it should be here today. I ordered it Monday, it's always two day delivery. So I was freaking out when I couldn't see the tracking and I heard the uh, FedEx all the way down the street and uh, he, came, he was like, wow, I've never seen you run out here so fast. I said, I've been waiting for you for like hours because they used to come early in the morning, but now that it's holidays, um, it's kind of crazy. So I do, Mandy, I got more. They've been out for like two weeks. Mommy's bad at, um, at uh, getting their product in. So, um, Yes, Patty. Steelers. Mandy's a Steeler fan too. We're diehard Steeler fans over here. So, if your kids are not thriving, it's called Thrive K. My girls love it. Um, it tastes like cereal, like a fruity cereal. It's the best way I can describe it. Um, and it's really good for them. Um, it has all the vitamins um, that it needs. And it's really good. So if you have kids and you want a trial pack and you want to try the kids, I will throw in a kids um, Thrive K for you. Um, I'll just have to more, more for the girls. And that's it. All right, guys. Hey, Lisa. Are you a Steelers fan too? Give me the hearts if you guys are Steeler fans on here, because I know there's a lot of you. These are so cool. I love this idea. And it fits in my little, um, my packaging that I send out as well. So I'm super excited. Um, I think that's it. All right, guys. Awesome, Lisa. I love it. I'm raising my girls. We're in, in Colorado, and um, being a Steeler fan here is like, Cece got Broncos gear from one of our friend's dad for her birthday um, as a joke. <laughs> and so that was, uh, we get it all the time. Every Sunday we get crap, but that's okay. I can handle it. They're from Target. They're really cute. They're not big and they're not, um, they're not small. I don't know what size they are. It doesn't say but they're really cute. Um, I took all the ones from our Target. Oops. Um, it'll be okay. Go get more. Um, so, hey, Tiff. So, I'm just putting together samples um, for my friends who are ready to experience Thrive. Yes, they're awesome. Um, so I'm really excited. All right, so I'm gonna go get these. I got two of them already um, spoken for. Um, as I was making them, the girls at the at Target wanted one. So I gotta bring them back one later. So message me, I'm putting these together right now. I am super excited. Um, lots of fun, uh, lots of Christmas cheer right here. Um, Christmas um, Thrive. If you're ready to experience it, message me um, and we'll go from there. Mandy, oh my gosh, me too. And I love not gaining weight on, on vacation. I used to gain weight on vacation between 7 and 10 pounds every time. And um, Port Verarta, I lost 4 pounds. 
which is ironic because I ate so much, so much food. Um, the food was incredible there. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. I'm actually in charge. We're going to a friend's house. One of my, um, one of my good friends has invited us over since, you know, we don't have much family here. Um, so we're going to her house for the holiday on Thanksgiving and I'm in charge of desserts. So knowing me coming from an Italian family, I won't make one. I'll probably make like four or five because I have to make one that the kids will eat and then a traditional one that I don't like. And then of course a couple of uh, other pastries of some sort. So, um, definitely going to be doing that and, uh, You'll see. I'll have pictures. I'll be baking all day um, and eating it as I go along because that's the best part. Who doesn't eat while you're baking? Um, and Bella's excited to help me this year. So, All right, another th uh, Thrive experience. Ready to go out. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging with me, Mandy. Um, do you want to hop on real quick before I say goodbye? I do need water, though. I'll give you a chance to respond. To town. Don't mind, I can't sing for the life of me. Santa's coming to town though. Mandy, you wanna hop on? Maybe she hopped off already. Yes, all right, awesome. I'm gonna invite you. Why didn't I up? Those are so cute, and I Aren't can't they? even wait to go Target because I was there yesterday <laughs> for like. What? No fair. I um, I went to three different stores yesterday. Hey, Christina. And I couldn't find anything that was small enough, but big enough. So there's always all those in-betweens. I mean, this is seriously perfect. Like, it's perfect. And I'm going to put some goodies in there, a surprise. To, um, and you know what I love that you said that you're going to take some samples back to the people at Target? Because, oh, my gosh, like, Madison just started working in retail. And, and I'm, like, going, all those people you have to deal with, like, you know how it is, like, having the patience now to be able oh to God. even put up. Like, they don't get hey, paid Sharon. enough money. No, and I did retail last Christmas. Right. Was it last year? I was working at Jim yeah. in the mall. And the last two, I, I've done retail for, I've, I've pretty much had to work every Christmas since I could remember because I was either waiting tables. Yeah. Um, in retail or in the medical field and all three of them are open on the holidays so um especially retail forget that everything the um doctor's office or hospital is chaotic right and up. even having like those jobs even in retail you know you're dealing with so many people which means germs and you know i'm a germaphobe right i've kind of had to be and you know i'm okay i can admit it but you know, having all the pre and probiotics in our bodies just helps me not get sick. And it would help, I mean, not only that, them having energy. All, well, I can't think of a single person this wouldn't help. So <laughs> I, know. I know, girl. That's why we're you know, so passionate and crazy about it. It saved me last winter when I was working in the children retail store. And it was a small store. So um, it was very uh, crowded. And people were pushing, people were rude, they were frustrated, irritated. Yes. You name it. I, and I, I can't, was in there in I my can't believe hat. you're um, even, you're giving away Christmas chocolate. I mean, that is a treat in itself. I feel it for the man, but at least you have all those credits. I mean, you just earned 200 credits in a promo I did last month. You know, like you have all those credits, so you just got all that product for free. This paid shipping is pretty cool. Yeah, I can't wait to get it into everyone's hands. So, um, I love that you're paying it forward. It. I just love that you pay it forward that way. It's such a good thing. Well, you paid it forward to me. Yeah. So I'm just following the um, trend because you know what? 
I'm glad you paid it forward to me. Because oh. look at us. I know, right? Driving. I'm happier when you talk to me. I actually answer the phone when you call me. Yeah. <laughs> I never wanted to talk on the phone before Thrive. I, I didn't like talking to people. No, you talked to me, but once I started promoting Thrive, you were like, I'm going to put you on the burner. <laughs> Back no, but I even but I got more busier when you started because I now had kids. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Bella was a baby when you started Thrive. You started Thrive in what year? 2014, right? Yeah. Bella was a year old, and not even probably when you started. Well, right but, about a year yeah. old. I was exhausted. And I was, was working. Yeah, that was that was that was different. You were in the process of moving and building a house and. But we've known yeah. each other for like close to 10 years now and have had, you know, similar health challenges. And I just knew this is something that you were going to take, whether I flew to Colorado or not, because I knew it would do something for you, just like yeah. it did for me. And it took me a year. So it took me a lo way too long. I kick my, if I could kick myself in the rear, I would. I know. I think people are like, me. what are vitamins going to do for me? But I'm like, you have no idea until you try this because. Exactly what I said. Exactly. I, I was just like, you don't get it, Addie. I take six vitamins a day, right? Well, for one, you know, they had chemicals in them. And for two, I didn't know that. And for two, they weren't 100% natural. And then for three, your body just doesn't even absorb them right. Or yeah. can't absorb them. So it's like, what is the sense? But I didn't know any of that. I thought it was okay because it said it was a vitamin and I paid for six of them, right? Yes, ma'am. I get it. I, I, I said the same thing to you. I was like, there's no way. I have these discomforts. This isn't going to help me. <laughs> Boy, was I wrong. Haha. <laughs> I love it. I love watching how it's changed. Oh, no, and Chris. Like, he has lost so much weight. Like, his transformation, well, both of you, is, like, incredible. But, oh, my gosh, the way I see it in his face. And then when we got to see each other in Mexico, I was, like, he is, like, so fit. Yeah. And, you know, the thing is, is he was always, when I met him, he was skinny fit. He's now healthy fit. Yeah. Which I love. Yeah. You know? actually healthy now he looks healthier he's you know his, he has more definition in his muscles and everything like he's definitely and he's running my husband loved working out loved 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 working out before I met him and then um but recently he's been running with our good friend one of my promoters Um, they go running um, all the time. Chris hated running. He hated it because he'd always get, um, uh, what are they called, like shin splints? Yeah. And so they bothered him a lot. And um, he doesn't have the discomforts like he did when he was running before. So now he does it for fun. Um, like the other night, he was like, it's a great weather outside. I'm going to go run. Is that cool? I'm like, bye. <laughs> That's you so know? great. And you know, like, like you were saying shin splints and stuff, like the white willow bark in our little DFT foam, it's like a natural Tylenol. That's what I think yeah. helps you and I get through, you know, the winter blahs, you know, where we can spring out of bed now and not, not have to wait 45 minutes to actually get moving, get going, you know, it's not that anymore we don't have time for that anyway we're we're full of energy and going <laughs> yeah and i love the better sleep yeah With having, uh, kids being sick the last couple of days i've had little sleep but still a lot of energy and yeah. i feel good so that's always good so if you guys are just joining me and mandy um i'm putting together a bunch of thrive experience uh stockings so if you're ready to experience thrive and feel as amazing as we do. I got these going for you guys. Hey, Mel. Um, so these are going out. I got 20 of them. I've been making them as we've been sitting here. They're all sitting here now. It's my last one. Um, I have two going back to Target because the girls were like, what are those for? I had to tell them. I told them it was a surprise, and they wanted to know what the surprise was. And then I just showed them my DFT. <laughs> <laughs> 
So um, bringing these back to the ladies. So that's why I was stalking the UPS, uh, the FedEx guy, because I wanted to do it before I had to go get the girls from school. So, um, and there's surprises going in these. So if you guys want a part of the Thrive experience, if you want to experience it, shoot me a message, comment below, give me a GIF, whatever they're called, uh, emoji, scream at me, yell at me, whatever. <laughs> you mean like I did to you? Yes, exactly. <laughs> And in each one of them, I'm going to put a little um, card that has all your um, instructions on how to take it. So definitely read those. Um, and my favorite part, you guys, is their Christmas DFTs. So cute and fun. I know. Like, look. Yeah, super fun. My favorite is the Jingle Lavelle. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm silly, but it's fun. It is fun. All right, guys. Fine. Yes, totally. So, um, thanks guys for hopping on. I'm playing Christmas music, just doing this, getting ready to do the decorations. I'm really nervous. I don't. My dad told me the same thing: tie the tree up. But I still don't trust Cece. Yeah, I was trying to type tether it to the wall, but then again, she'll climb it anyway. It won't matter. <laughs> I know. I'm really oh, nervous. I may just put one tree up instead of all of them. But we'll see. We have a tree. We have a... Um... You might have to tether Cece instead of tether the tree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know. When, uh, we have like, a, a, like a, a landing or a loft, whatever, in front of our front room where we put like a little white tree. Um, and so... That's where we put a tree. So that just might be the only tree. And the first year we did that, we put all their Christmas presents up there. So they couldn't touch them. They could just see them. So that might just be what we do again. Hey, Mom. Thanks, Joe. Um, but, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's what Joey. we just want to do. With Joey. What, honey? I went to school with Joey. Oh, nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was looking for my Steelers um, Christmas hat, but Bella had it, and I don't know what she did with it. Oh. She likes it. I got to get her another one. Yeah. Well, it looks like you're having an awesome day. Love the idea. Let's definitely share that with our team because it's adorable. And make it, it is. want one. And I'm going to have to do that too, which gives me another reason to go to Target. So win-win. What else? <laughs> Without All right, awesome. <laughs> is that a tree up already? That is, yes. Well, that's my little small tree that I have upstairs. But I'll show you. We did put the big one downstairs today. Oh, nice. Yeah. Um, I'm not waiting. To... I'm in the mood. Mom and I went to the Biltmore Estates, and it was all decked out for Christmas it's the so... other week. And so I'm like, sorry, I'm not waiting. Sorry, not sorry. Yeah. I was in the attic today doing all this stuff, and I'm ready. Yeah. I um. Oh my God, Amanda said they knocked down theirs four times last year, their Christmas tree. And she's got a tribe <laughs> over there. A tribe. I know she does. <laughs> um, Biltmore is amazing during Christmas. I went, um, geez, 2004, I think it was, last time I went. It's absolutely gorgeous. It is, it is. And Mom and I, we just had a great time, and it was the perfect time in Asheville with the leaves were changing. And we got yeah. our taste of the mountains, and it was it was something else. Okay, one minute, Dieter. I know. If it's not the kids, it's the dog nagging me. So I can <laughs> let him out. I love you guys. Thank love you. Love you, too. Thank you. Bye, guys. See ya.